Laura Styles, our guest today, yes. Cranium, from, Cranium Queens. from Queens. Well, I mean, Jamaica Queens, <laughs> not Jamaica Queens, but Jamaica then Queens, yeah. then maybe Jamaica Queens, yeah. and then some Long Island, but then back to Queens. Yeah. yeah. Is that, but I got he, that but right? But he reps Queens. Yeah, I rep Queens, but you know, born Jamaican. Yeah. And based overseas. Yeah. And for the audience that may not know this young man, he had one of the biggest reggae songs of 2014. Yeah. Unbeknownst to many, but Drake knew what was popping. Drake <laughs> hit that stage. How does she sing the tune? Every time she comes, she go like she know and do it. And I tell me about her sneak, she a sneak. But from me looking at her, I miss the freakiness. Cause nobody not for know, say me and you a touch. Nobody not for know, say you a give it up. Nobody not for know, say you come over me yard. Baby, you know me love you back. And so Drake, obviously, being from Toronto, and there's a lot of West Indians in Toronto, he knew what time it is with that. He goes on stage singing your song. Yeah. It's a big deal for you. Yeah. And everybody knew, oh, Drake's giving our guy cranium love. Like, yeah, I'm woo, a... yeah. Everybody was texting you. You saw it all over woo. social media. Yeah, I saw it everywhere. I was like, yeah. Did dope. he ever invite you to OVO Fest? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, actually, I was in, I was in, I was in Caribana. I yeah, was, was in Canada at the time when OVFS was going on. I had shows. So, so you were in Canada. And he was he, right around the corner. And he still yeah, didn't invite. I mean, you. maybe he tried to reach out. I don't know. We didn't get. You know, we didn't get. You didn't have did you sell? You couldn't just forward him some sell? minutes. Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Team over. <mobile. laughs> I was playing. I know. Uh, shout to Digicel. The reason I give him a shout out is they advertise around this piece. Big up. Right. Um. So anyway, Cranium, that was a big moment for you. But no uh, conversation with Drake. No follow up. No opportunity there. Nah. But it was love it's, though. It was love. Yeah. It's cool. And man. he made the song more popular. Yeah. I mean, he did. He, he did the song justice. A lot of people who didn't know the song who was a fan of Drake knew the song after that. Right. So it was good. You know what I mean? At the end of the day. That's Drake singing your song, you know? So right, right. It means a lot. And I'm, I'm and now he has a song. Nobody has to know the remix that just came out with Ty Dolla Sign. Oh, well, now Ty Dolla Sign showing love. He jumped on it. He know what yeah. time it is. <laughs> <laughs> well, Ty Dolla Sign, that type of dude, though. You know yeah. what I mean? He he's, he keeps it a secret. There's a couple of girls running around here that, you know what I mean? I think he touching on, too, yeah. and okay, trying to keep it okay, low. Okay, yeah. okay. Because he, he shows up here way too often. Mm. To talk about. You know how, like, when an artist come by, <laughs> Ebro in the morning, High 9 7, they come by. He be like, yo, money, why you... You don't and, have and, any, and all of a sudden you, there's like new girls in the room. Like, hold up, you mm, never walk in any of these interviews. And you don't dress like this. Why you dress like this now? The Ty Dolla <laughs> Sign. I, <know. laughs> yeah, I mean, hey, that's the guy that said part. How did you meet so. Ty Dolla Sign? Like, how'd you guys link up? Actually, you know, we 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 I got signed to Atlantic. Okay. Congratulations. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Oh, they and they have a history that Atlantic Records and I'm assuming Craig Cowman for acknowledging yeah. the big the 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 right reggae tunes yeah. working with VP Records and many other other yeah. things big beat and all that. Yeah. So uh, when I got signed, you know, we decided that we wanted to relaunch the song, and we said we wanted somebody in the record, and then you know names came up and stuff like that. And Tyler signed this. I when they sent me the record, I was like, yo. This is it. I don't really want to hear no anything No brainer. Yeah, it was no brainer. Yeah, he killed it. You know, he, he bring the vibes with it. And the, the, the greatest thing about the record was that he did it being himself. He didn't try to be a dancehall artist on the record. He just be... Is that dancer. annoying when artists try to like... Yeah, I don't... I don't yeah, sometimes <laughs> it's dope. It <laughs> I mean, sometimes it's dope, <laughs> though. I ain't gonna lie. Sometimes it's dope, but... <laughs> You know what I mean? I'm not. I, 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 if if it's already a reggae track, I don't want to hear. Yeah. You know, yeah. Ty Dolla Sign singing reggae. I want to hear just beat Ty Dolla Sign. Yeah, and that's yeah, exactly yeah. what he did. That was dope <laughs> as hell. You know what I mean? So it worked. Um. So now, um, that you're you're still focused on this one record, which is kind of a new philosophy. Yeah. Well, not new. It's an old philosophy, but you and your team have adopted this philosophy of like, yo, we're gonna stay on this song because we know it's a hit. Yeah. And for an extended period of time, this song has been. Your focus for now, how long? Yeah. For like two years. Two years, it's one single. Yeah. And it was already big in Jamaica, it's yeah. big in New York. We played on the radio, yeah. it came, it went, people still play it in the dance. Yeah. Because I, I feel like there's a difference between having a song and working a song. And mm -hmm. when you work a song, you, you see the difference in it. Meaning, we, we took this song from the streets of Queens, New York, and this song become one of the biggest songs. I tore the world off that song. You know, and it's just that. I feel like artists need to, to, to realize that when you have something good, don't just let it go. If you feel like it haven't been where it's supposed to go, don't not because it reached at a certain point, you feel like, okay, it's a hit, leave it there. Because mm -hmm. in dancehall music, I feel like we need that structure, would I say that machine behind to take it beyond just a dancehall record. Mm. So that's what, I, that's, that's what I've been focusing on. I'm like, you know what, I don't care what people want to say, you know, that song is keeping me relevant and 
It's a huge song. And you want it to be more than just. Of course. Because Sean Paul was signed to Atlantic, right? Yeah. Sean Paul, Wayne Wonder, um, Kevin Little. Yeah. yeah, and they those who they had a string of hits. Yeah, that was what. What years was that, brother? Two thousand three. Yeah. Two thousand three. Yeah. Yeah. Two thousand three through about two thousand five, right? Yeah. Mm, yeah. And then the Elephant Man came in and run like yeah, 05 Man. and then yeah. the Little John and you know that thing took off for a second. Yeah. Yeah, that was the good days on the Parkway. Yeah. How's that Parkway now? We ain't been out there. Hot Nine Seven ain't been out there in a minute. It's parkway good. ain't what it used to be, huh? Nobody's on that parkway having fun like that. No. Even before 2 p.m. You, you're talking about the because West. remember, there was a cutoff. In about 2006, Eastern Parkway, Labor Day Parade weekend. Yeah, no, I used to make sure the Hot 97 truck was out of there by 5 o'clock. Uh. And sometimes they would try to stall us and keep us. And I was like, nah, B, y'all don't want us around here when the sun starts to go down. <laughs> mm. Craziest thing I've ever been there once, to be honest with you. So. Really? Yeah, I've been But there now, once. look, I think... But I how, how crazy does it get, Ibra? i never been. I mean... It's like, crazy, what do you man. mean by crazy? It's fun, man. You know? I mean, yeah, that's it's what a, I would... It's a great would... family event. Yeah. Okay. From 9 a.m. Yeah. Take the kids, have some food, enjoy yeah. the costumes, the fun, music. Fun, fun, yeah. okay. Fun. But remember, this is um, Labor Day weekend. This is at the ass end, so you've had Juve. You've had concerts in the park. You've yeah. had our con. You've had. I mean, it's been an entire weekend. People so been drinking. They've been drinking for three smoking. days, really? and it, the sun is going down. They got to go back to work the next day. So that la it's that last like six p.m. to ten p.m. at the end of the parade, yeah, where people are just like, I don't know, like school about to start the next day. It was just so <laughs> much. I got to go back to work. I've been, and then all the frustration comes out. And it's a fight or something. Something always mm -hmm. happens. I mean, it's funny, man. You see some, and then and then it's crazy. in Brooklyn, right? So there's things that just happen because you're in Brooklyn that they try to tie to the parade, and you'll be like, "Nah, that's just <laughs> that's just Brooklyn." Like you know, <laughs> that would have happened on Wednesday. <laughs> that would have happened on Wednesday. You know what I mean? Do that's so. True, man. You never know if it's the parade or just Brooklyn. Yeah. You know. Hey. So Cranium, um, now that you're signed to Atlantic, are we gonna now you have this remix? Yeah. Uh, let's play that and then tell us what's the next step. If this remix bubbles, it keeps you going. Is there yeah. an album or another single? How you gonna move? We, we, we drop, I, I mean, um, in the dance world, there's a song that's called Lifestyle that I, that we dropped. Mm, I don't know this. One. Yeah, it's, it's it's pretty big. It's pretty pretty big. That's so, your next. And, um, we we drop in the um a mixtape. In September, mm. we had a date, but we changed it because iTunes now changed the date of when you can actually put up songs during the week. So we have to pick a date. It's only released. I think you only can put songs now. on Fridays now. Yeah. So yeah. we have to change the date from that. All music comes out on Friday, says yeah. iTunes. Really? Oh. Yep. So no more. Well, because the two, well, because the Tuesday thing was like a retail thing, mm -hmm. like the stores, right? Who goes to? A, there's not a lot of stores to go to, yeah. right? Because they would ship the music on a Saturday, Friday mm -hmm. night, Saturday. Then they would stock the show, or maybe it was like on a Sunday night. It would arrive on Monday. Then they would stock the shelves, and people go buy the music on Tuesday. But since people don't go to retail like that to the actual store, they right. go online. It's like, well, yeah. well, it's put up on Friday, and I think people do a lot of online shopping okay. on the weekend, so they put music up on Fridays. That's yeah. what iTunes said. The biggest, move iTunes, the biggest right? digital retail. I didn't even look at it like that. That makes a lot of sense. That's what it is. Yeah. So that's what happened. We supposed to, as I said, drop it and then the dates change. So um, the, the, the mixtape should be coming out in September. And as I said, we work in lifestyle and as a shirt, a history of a song called History in the Streets right now that's doing good also. So what do you, we should play this remix first, expose yeah. people to the Todd Dollar song. Yeah. And then if you want us to feature another one right now, what song you want us to play for the people? Lifestyle. Lifestyle. Most definitely. All right, we'll get that on. Yo, man, salute to you, man. You know you got an open door policy here. Love your whole team. I'm Respect. happy for you signing to Atlantic Records. Mad. Um, you're not. You don't have any side pieces anymore. You're not <laughs> trying to. <laughs> nothing that changed, man. You said nothing changed. Ain't nothing changed. Man. So you doing this? Are you? Well, I'm singlish, man. I'm singlish. So singlish. Yeah, so nothing changed. <laughs> yeah, that's so funny. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, yeah, don't get him in trouble, man. Just let him. I break. think last time he got himself in trouble. <laughs> uh. Yeah, somewhat. So, but no, I'm Singlish. So I don't even good. Know Last that... time I wasn't Singlish. No, I'm Singlish. So, should I, I, should I even ask you what that means? It's English. He had a girl holding him down, and then he became a superstar, and then he went out and toured the world. Yeah. And while he was touring the world, he was like, "Listen, let's you, get involved. You don't have to know." <laughs> <laughs> And then she found out, and then things got. And then she had to know. No, nah, yeah. and then it, it was a problem. No, nah, you can't. You can't sing something without living up to it. So if anything I do is not gonna know, period. But I'm just English. 
Yeah. So that's going to be one it's of your... You're going to have a single called I Singlish? I change spot no more. I don't go to Deer Park anymore. You know, I switch it up. So. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Yeah. Yo, yeah. give it up for Cranio. He brought in the morning Hot 97. Here you go. Check out the remix with Ty Dolla Sign. Sit down here, that's up. Bend down here, that's up. Bend down here, that's up. Sit down here, that's up. I've been waiting Nobody nothing know say me and you a touch Nobody nothing know say you a give it up Nobody nothing know say you come over me yard Baby, you know me love you bad Nobody nothing know say me and you a touch Nobody nothing know say you a give it up Nobody nothing know say you come over me yard Baby, you know me love you bad Every time you come here, act like you know I'm weak. And I tell me, say I sneak, you a sneak. But from looking at your eyes, me see the freakiness. Baby girl, make it a leash. And I like, say, me no treat you good. And I like, say, me no go hard. Every time you come on me yard, you a worry and your man there your yard. Mm. Nobody nothing know, say me and you a touch. No Nobody nothing know, know, say you a give it up. No Nobody nothing know, know, say you come over me yard. Baby, Baby you know me love your body. Mm. Nobody nothing know, know, say me and you a touch. Mm. Nobody nothing know, know, say you a give it up. Mm. Nobody nothing know, know, say you come over me yard. Baby, you know me love your body. Girl, girl, take it off for a young Freaky teens that you do with your tongue Up and down the pool like a stripper What's up, face in the pillow